At age four, she battled multiple organ failures and underwent successful kidney transplant. Today, at age 10, seems like she's 35 years old, she's performing around the country after making it to the finale of America's Got Talent. How about that? Please welcome Angelica Hale to the show. Hi, Angelica. It is so nice to meet you, too. So, when you started singing, about how old were you? Well, I was about three years old, and, you know, I was just singing in the back of the car, just singing along to the radio, and, you know, that, that was my passion, you know? I just went on and went on, and I got put in voice lessons, and I like that. So, that helped me get to where I am today, so, yeah. And, and what about insp musical inspirations? Do you have a lot of singers that you look up to? One person, Whitney Houston. I love her so much, and I think we can all agree that she's a legend. She is amazing. I love her voice. It's so soulful, and, you know, she has many, many inspirational songs, so I love her song. She She does. And would you sort of try to imitate her when you were younger? Is that what you'd do, or...? Yeah, I would always, like, imitate, like, I would always, like, but you don't always be yourself, you know? Yeah, you're right about be that. Be your own self, and that's what makes you stand out from the others. Okay, who are you? <laughs> You know, it kind of seems like you're thinking of I'm like, some kind of like internet quote person. You know? <laughs> no, 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 no. I didn't mean that at all. I <laughs> meant fine. you're very, you're, you're very special, Aww. and you're very, very smart and very composed. Many people your age would come on this big TV show with all the lights, and they'd be shaking and nervous. But you oh, no. look not at all. Oh, thank you. <laughs> what makes you nervous? Does anything get you nervous? Well, yeah. Sometimes if I'm, like, I'm about to go on and I'm like standing backstage and everything's like so suspenseful, I'm like, no, 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 like, oh my god, oh my god, what's going on? <laughs> so, but you know what I say to myself when I get nervous? Tell me, I want to know. I've been through so much more than this. You're not kidding. Mm -mm. You're not kidding. That, that that is true. Yeah, and. I just said to myself, you can do this. And like, some advice I would give to other people, like just be yourself and nothing will go wrong. You're be right about that. Is one of the best things you can do. <laughs> now, tell me about season 12 of AGT. Was that just one of the great experiences? My gosh, first of all, let me say, it was absolutely amazing. <laughs> and oh man, I really didn't think I'd make, I'd make it that far, but I actually got the golden buzzer in judge cuts, and I couldn't believe it. It was unbelievable. So Angelica's mom and dad, Eva and James, are in the audience today. Hi, guys. How's it going? How are you? Hello. <laughs> so how does it feel to see this incredible young woman's talent just take off? Are you just blown away? Man, we are so lucky. We're so blessed. I mean, you know, she's a miracle. You know, when she was four years old, like you said, I mean, she came down with a really bad pneumonia, which led to her going uh, into septic shock and multiple organ failure, and, you know, her kidneys stopped working. So, uh, Mommy and I got tested, and uh, I wasn't a match, but, you know, thankfully she was, and she was courageous enough to give Angelica one of her kidneys. I love that. I... Do you believe in miracles? I believe in all miracles. I believe in miracles, too, and I, I believe you're a miracle, and I also believe that man... And that woman in the audience of Miracles, too, to have parents like that who love you so much. Yeah. That's a very special kind of miracle. I know that not all kids in this world have those kind of supporting parents. You're right about that. You're, you're very, very blessed, and they are, too.